morning guys <laughs> well I am now on day five and I'm determined to make today the day that I seriously get focused on what I'm eating and just rate seriously rate until I'm hungry that's one thing I'm not doing I'm not rating until I'm seriously hungry and I'm determined I'm going to do it. I am so determined. Let me just kind of refresh you on the basics of the way down. Basically, it's eating when you're hungry and stopping when you're satisfied. When you feel that, just beginning to feel that you have ate. Or like when the foods no longer really appeal as you eat them. A good time to quit. You drink water in between meals, but with a meal you can drink anything. A wine, a sugared coffee, a special tea, uh, a soda, whatever. Uh, but in between meals, either a water, black coffee, unsweetened tea, you know, anything that doesn't have calories or sugar. Um, you can even drink a zero sugar diet soda. You can even do that in between meals. Um, also, it is uh, making sure that it's all on timing. Like if it's about time to eat with your family, but you had just ate because you you was hungry beforehand, or even a social meeting, then you just sit and enjoy something that's sugar free so that you're doing your social group or if it's close time to eat with your social group then you just hold off until then just simple things like that and on a Christian standpoint if you find yourself struggling ask God to help you with it you'll find that he will um, the writer of the book had said to ask God to give you a distraction so that when you come back to the food it's just not appealing anymore or when you're finished throw a napkin on it or something or push it away or something or get up and walk away or something instead of sitting there and nibbling and another thing if you're done eating and there's still a little bit left don't eat it just even let that little bit go. So little things like that. And always remember, no matter what kind of diet plan you're on, um, it doesn't matter. Vegetarian, vegan, Mediterranean, uh, paleo, keto, or any of these newfangled diets that's out there, whatever. You can also utilize the way down with it. Just go on ahead and practice the way down with that. And you'll see that you can do that. Anyway, I will be with you in a little bit when I have my first meal. Okay, so I'm hungry. And this is what I'm choosing for my first meal. Some more checks and the kicks with the marshmallows. It is 8.43. Uh, more than likely this will all be ate. But in time, I do believe that I will be eating less cereal if none at all because I don't ever buy it because I'm weak anyway I'll get back with you later. okay so here I am walking I am determined to wait until I'm hungry again before I eat and I'm not going to go work so I'm going to try to put in as many miles as possible today burn as many calories as I can so um there was something else that I was wanting to remind you of. I guess it was just that I wasn't going to go urban today, so I was going to be putting in steps. But anyway, um, as it happens, I'm going to make the best of today. Watch and see. I'll get back at you after a while. Okay, I am very hungry again. I'm going to be having curry chicken with ranch dressing 
a pack of Nico candy wrappers and my green tea and it is 116 I'll be back with you in a little bit okay so I'm having an early dinner and this is ultimate cheeseburger helper and I'm having a can of coke and I will get back with you a little later all right so this is the end of the day for me for day five and um, well my portions are getting smaller as you can see I'm using a small plate and I am leaving some food um, today I didn't leave any food but it was still on a small plate every time as you saw but this evening I kind of went on a binge um, let's just say it wasn't very good so I've got to get that under as well and pray to God about that as much as I do about other things I've just I gotta stay focused anyway let's go on ahead and see what I done on the Fitbit let me pull it off here because <laughs> I've still got it on my waist okay I've got 5587 steps make sure I got that up for you glare eight flights of stairs 2.36 miles and 1,904 calories now the reason for the lack of walking is um, it had started to rain so I couldn't get the laps in that I had wanted but I did do some walking earlier as you saw so I did get some in just not what I wanted anyway um, I did do the gym once again it's a total body gym one of those mechanisms has got the rates so that you you can work your entire body. I did that again, 15 count. So, um, yeah, I've just I've got to keep focused and continue making it a challenge because I really want to get my stomach smaller. Um, not only is it obscene to look at, it just you know unpleasant but there's also some things that's bothersome about it for one it poses a little bit of a problem for breathing for two it just it seems to like cause me a little bit of acid trouble so I've got to keep from eating a lot and just stick to when I'm hungry in the smaller portions and stopping when satisfied and just letting that be it instead of snacking when I'm not really hungry you know allow my stomach to empty up and that's the whole point behind it so yeah there's um, some issues for me to address and pray about and just let God help me and I keep it in practice so that it becomes a um, good habit for me. Anyway guys, I appreciate you and you all are awesome. If you're new to this channel, thank you. I appreciate it. If this is your first time viewing, please like, subscribe, and share. I would love to see you join my YouTube family and friends. As I said, you all are awesome, and I really greatly appreciate you. I'll see you on the next video, and 
you all have a great day.